The South Africa Police Service broke its protocol in announcing the death of Meiwa, but requested that there be calm and that the police would do all that it could to bring Meiwa's killers to book. They are also offering a 150,000 rand reward for information that could lead to the arrest of the killers. The 27-year-old Meiwa captained South Africa in their last four matches in the 2015 Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers. He played on Saturday and helped Pirates to a 4-1 win over Ajax Cape Town in the quarter-final of the Telcom Knockout Cup. Meiwa's death follows that of another prominent South African sportsman, former World 800-meter champion Mbulaweni Mulaotsi, who died in a car accident on Friday. In an official statement on their Facebook page, the chairman of Orlando Pirates, Ivan Koza, said that it's a sad loss whichever way you look at it. To Meiwa's family, especially his children, to Orlando Pirates and to the nation. The club will hold a press conference at 11 o'clock this morning. The goalkeeper began his football career as a striker for London Cosmos in his hometown Umlazi in KwaZulu-Natal. Shortly after his conversion to the number one position, Meiwa went on to represent his province in the Transnet Under-14 and Coca-Cola Under-17 interprovincial tournaments in 2000 as a 13-year-old. It was at one of these competitions that the young Meiwa was identified by scouts and was snapped up by the Pirates Development Academy. After impressing at development level and earning the tag of best keeper of the academy, Meiwa got his big break to play for the first team in the 2005-2006 season. However, it was only in 2007 when he made his mark at the club. In that season, Meiwa cemented his place as Pirates' first choice keeper, making a total of 24 league appearances for the club, far exceeding his record of one appearance in the previous campaign. But following a successful 2007-2008 season, the former South African under-23 international had to face stern competition with the arrival of Bafana Bafana goalkeeper Muneeb Josephs at Pirates. He was Josephs' understudy, but again got his big break when Josephs was benched in a league game due to injury. Since getting the nod as first-choice keeper, Maywe never looked back. He literally carried the club in the African Champions League 2013 edition, making a number of important saves and guiding the team to the finals of the tournament. In recent months, Maywe played four AFCON qualifiers and kept a clean sheet. He also captained the team in the absence of regular keeper and skipper Itumelen Kune.